Stand by medical, stand by medical. We have a 24 year old male complaining of an NDA, possible broken arm. Medics copy. Uh, my name is Senior Airman Jose Bustos Flores, and I'm an ambulance service technician. As ambulance services, uh, we are the first medical responders to any type of accident. We get a call on the radio, and we are there. Um, one of us picks up the emergency bags, and the other one picks up the ambulance. One of us is finding a, the exact location, and if they if they tell us what's going on with the patient, my partner and I will start brainstorming. Definitely consider C-spine mobilization the moment we get there. Uh, so somebody will hold the, the patient's neck, the patient's head and neck. If there is a, a injury to the spine could potentially uh, cause severe damage, uh, permanent damage to the spine. We'll be doing a head-to-toe assessment, uh, definitely checking for any, any open wounds, any bleeding. Most likely we will put them on the spine board. Once we get the patient in the rig, a lot of the secondary things we will check for you know, more bleeding, throw an IV in, uh, get some fluids going. As ambulance services, we cannot afford to make mistakes. Something like losing a patient because of a mistake I did is, it's one of those things I don't think anybody wants to ever go through in their life. You know, it could be somebody's husband or wife or daughter or son. If we went on a call and we helped the patient, we made a difference. We might have not made a, a difference in the entire world, you know, like a, a world-changing difference, but we made a difference for that specific patient. At the end of the day, after the transport, and we know that the patient is, is good to go, that makes me feel amazing, because I, I made a difference. You know, I can, I can tell myself that I, I did some good in the world.